Oh, hey there. I'm in a good mood today. Rare occasion. I got my beauty sleep last night. Rare occasion. Uh, I'm going to drop some poetry. Medium rare occasion. <laughs> this one is entitled Swimming. And it's a love letter for all my fellow life forms. As I laugh to myself, in the isolated hours of my late night quest for slumber, I realize that oftentimes I must truly question my sanity, my intellectual capacities, my self-diagnosis and the weight of what I have believed to have been the remedies, my hunger, my thirst for life, for the pool that has always flowed by my side, fulfilled my needs, and been my guide as these inward-turned eyes burned and hovered in the conclusions based off the assumption made by the illusion that my entire life has been spent lost, dry-throated, and empty-handed as I wander aimlessly alone through the desert. I would question my own vanity. But I can't decide if I'm incredibly vain or if this endless game of building self-reliance has thus forced me to become my own muse. And then I question, what's the use? Why does one part of me long to feel distant from you for a sense of personal identity? While this well-watered depth of gratitude pulls itself from the limitless pools of my own soul. To be sent cascading through these physical outlets of blood and tears to feel you near when I find myself in bed during nights like this, alone. To know we share the same home. Your heart is my heart. Your sins are my own. Your eyes stare at me and find themselves peering back into multi-paneled layers of endless bounties feeding off their own nourishment to be reflected back into the bottomless eyes of God. Your touch extends beyond the nerve as ghastly fingers penetrate in radiant undulations places deeper than the skeleton, places beyond human logic, beyond mathematics and explanation, places which can only be unlocked by the skeleton key of love. And I realize my entire life, my entire life has been spent thirsting in the desert for just one drop of your humility. To taste that drop would change the world to color, would spread galaxy upon galaxy of unfolding cosmic energy, of planets hovering in what is perceived to be distance and yet connected by the heart fire warmth of the universal blanket that lulls us all to sleep together. I am so in love with you. I am dying to live forever, to catch myself in the endeavor of seeing how deep this connection can go, to see how high its seeds can grow, to see the blossoms unfold in synchronized choreography with the petals of my own heart. I would peel them all off for you. They were yours right from the start. I commit myself to this, for to part is just another part of being able to step outside to say, I do, I do.